Are we at a point now where American citizens should be allowed to return to their country without testing uh, negative? You know, I'm not... Thank you for the question. It's an important question. I don't have the answer to that. I mean, we work with our CDC colleagues to continue to examine the feasibility of that and the desirability of that. I think the idea of of uh, having an immigration issue mixed with a public health issue for the general population, I think those probably should be separated. Well, except they're interrelated because they're both involved groups of people entering the United States, one group is citizens of the country entering legally. The other group, frankly, are people that are not entering legally. The group that's not entering legally, even if they test positive, if they're even tested, get to stay, the American citizen can't re-enter their own country until they produce a negative. T and my point is, if, if we've reached a point in COVID where we no longer need Title 42 as a COVID restriction for illegal entry, why do we still need travel restrictions for American citizens for legal entry into their own country? That's the genesis of the question. That's where I think the link is. The, it sort of seems to be at odds with it. Yeah. All right. Thank you.